look at this new bike day for Barca yes. so bike check coming next week in the Swiss Alps the view is gonna be also really nice it's nice here but it's gonna be even better Santé du Moulin Québec Haute Maestrum sort of a new from last year add on to the Maestrum a little more technical than the Maestrum nice and long bridges Got a ton of rocks. Ooh, this one sort of tricky. Ooh. And it rained yesterday, so the rocks are a little slippery. Definitely not a beginner trail. But it's not the hardest trail here either. <laughs> Just avoiding the water. Woo. Nice little jump. Whee. <laughs> All right. Mark has a no trail, but Felix does. This one you have to cut early. If not, you can't make it. Oh, Felix knew it, but still didn't make it. Made it. Yes. Love it. Woo -woo. Usually, I don't make it, so that's why I'm happy I did for the camera. This is a lot of rocks. Oh, Mark has, is on his brand new bike with his, his dropper post. First ride ever on the dropper post, so just getting used to it. So we're done the Oat Maestrum. Now dropping into the Maestrum. Sweet trail. Way less technical than the Oat Maestrum. More flow, jump sperms. Still some, a little bit of technical stuff. But this one is definitely a ton of fun. We got a pretty solid like hour of rain yesterday, so there's some puddles everywhere. Oh, I like this one. And this one too. Woo -hoo. Two nice little step down here. This one. What? A little bit of transfer. Oh. Oh. <laughs> There's a little hole there. Um, oh yes, yeah, so we have a new microphone for the GoPro because I was getting really annoyed at the wind blowing. So Right now we're going fast, so let's really hope it works. I would be so happy if it works. But other than that, we're having more fun than... Truck crossing moto. My light. Wait! We are having... Well, I am anyway. 
so much fun right now. It's probably one of my favorite trail around Quebec. It just like flows so nice. And there's like a nice mix of technical stuff to keep it like interesting. It's not just like berms and jumps. It's like, oh, here's a rock and some where you have to like actually think. And the jumps are not too big that like everyone can like jump them for sure. Or like most people. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ain't nobody's gonna slow me down. <laughs> yeah, I was saying that trail is built really nice. Um, there's flow, but you have always enough speed for everything without having to like sprint. So, to always well, on my list of trails to do when I'm riding here. Like here, oh, two rocks. And like a nice big bridge. Just jump at the end. And some more rocks. Oh, I like this one. <laughs> Compressions. It does get like pretty bumpy by the end of the year, but right now, and the June, still super, super good. Oh, I don't like this one. There's no landing. Oh, yes. Inside line. The bottom part more uh, super fast and less like actual corners some straighter lines oh. for the amount of people that ride this trail every week or every day it is an insanely good condition Oh well, these ones are big enough, they do slow me down. Last section of the trail. And what's so cool about it is that when you get to the bottom, you're right back at the climb. So you can like loop it all day if you want. Tiny bit of pedaling here, but honestly. I'll take that much pedaling oh, all day for that descent. Couple more corners. Yes, car up. 